Senior pastor of Citadel Global Community Church, Sunday Bakary, says it is time to consolidate on the gains of the NSAS protest championed by Nigerian youth. Pastor Bakary, while addressing journalists after his State of the Nation broadcast in the church, advised that this becomes necessary in order not to allow the blood of the victims of the struggle go in vain. The Lagos State Governor had gone to that place to appeal to these people. They abused him, they yapped him. He quickly gathered all they had to say and went to Abuja to present the people's demand to the president. Instantly, they accepted all the five points. They disbanded SARS. And then they came up with, oh, they said that before. Uh, that's how they, we are not leaving. Uh, 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 uh. Believe me, the first five days of that protest was most impactful. And because we foresaw trouble, as I was talking to the presidency, I was talking to young people. I called some of their icons. I remember speaking to one of them for one hour, 15 minutes on the phone. Tell me what's going on. Don't do it this way. Let's do it this way. But outside there, they think others don't care. Everything in life is not about protest. We must make progress. I trust God that this will produce uh, lasting results so that we know, first and foremost, how to protest and how and not to allow those vultures who are waiting for opportunity to attack. Reacting to the wanton destruction of public infrastructure and some isolated media houses, the clergyman condemned the action in its entirety, warning that the side effect can be counterproductive. If you whoever buy its crime, and everyone involved, if they can catch their campaigns, they should be brought to book because you have ruined others. Look at the palace of, of, of Lagos or the palace of Shawn of Ogumosh of God's sake. That's our heritage. That's, they, will pre, they will preserve, the military and everybody will preserve that with their lives overseas mm. to ensure those things are not burnt. Mm. And we allow some hooligan to go do that. We, we will not, that should not be tolerated in any civil society, in any peaceful environment. Having said that, do you blame the hooligans also and just say, um, uh, to hell with you? An I do man's head is a devil's workshop. Look at massive army of unemployed youth. They just took advantage of what has happened to begin to take what they think belongs to them in an unlawful manner. I can't stand the thought of burning down TVC Ah, but those who are employed there. TVC is one of the television stations you want to watch abroad today. It has such a reach. Now we have damaged it. Nations newspaper, you have damaged the press. There are people benefiting from it day and night. And you know what? The Yoruba say when you throw a stone to the market, it will hit your relation. Maybe somebody who is a burden one of those truants has lost a job now. 